Hello there, um, a video by Mr. Evans here on uh, Blake Mouton. Uh, so, uh, looking at the Blake Mouton grid in this uh, video. Um, what is Blake Mouton? It's a model of leadership that considers the extent to which managers are concerned for both members of their team and the production of goods and services. So, uh, this um, we this theory is presented as a grid um, with two axes. We've got concern for people here. Uh, the manager's concern for people may be low or it may be high. And concern for the production aspect of the business down here. Again, low to high. So, um, I mean, it's fairly obvious, isn't it? You want a manager who has got a high concern for people and a high concern uh, for uh, production. So let's go there first. This is what we want our leader to be. And this leadership style is known as team leader. Um, they are likely to be using a theory Y type management style. I will do a video on exactly what that means, but um, essentially uh, the team leader is going to be uh, concerned with uh, creating an environment where uh, people are happy, the team is happy, um, but also the team is responsible for um, making the goods and services to a high standard, meeting customers' needs. So this would be a manager that, that demonstrates a um, keen uh, resolve to make sure that the workers are happy, but also holding those workers to account and making sure that they are um, producing goods and services to the required standard would be a very good leader to work under. They would probably be developmental, um, coaching the best out of you, helping you move to the next level in your career. Um, so yeah, so that's where we want to be. Uh, now let's have a look at some of these other places where people can go wrong. We'll start with the country club manager. So this is somebody who's got a high concern for people but is less concerned about production. So what would it be like to be in a company that has um, a country club style manager or management team? Well, probably it would be quite a happy place to work. The, the management team would be concerned with making sure that uh, the staff are getting on, um, probably looking at conflict uh, avoidance rather than conflict re resolution I would, I would say. Um, the team leader would be more interested in conflict resolution, let's solve these problems. Perhaps the country club manager would be more interested in putting them under the carpet and avoiding them in the first place. Um, uh, but at the same time, well, you know, while the workforce may be happy, um, there may be a lack of productivity, uh, quality control. I mean, I think of David Brent from The Office, if uh, well worth watching. He, uh, you know, talks about his high concern for people and some of the clips of the staff there. They sort of uh, uh, messing about when they should really be working, but they look quite reasonably happy. So anyway. Um, so that would be a country club manager. Um, the produce or perish leader would be almost the opposite. Um, just trying to get things done. Uh, very little concern for people. Uh, theory X, uh, management style, you know, all the focus is on, on getting the goods produced. The use of rules and procedures uh, to make sure that people are following rules. Um, you know, I think of a manager with relatively low regard for their workers' uh, health and safety. They're just trying to meet the targets that have been set. Um, so, uh, yeah, the produce or, or perish 
uh, leader. I mean, the one thing that you can say in their favour is that at least the staff would probably be quite productive, even though that um, may have been uh, achieved with the use of rules, regulations and, and fear. Finally, our, our worst kind of leader within the uh, grid, the impoverished leader who doesn't show any concern for people and production, you're going to have unhappy team members producing poor quality results. Um, yeah, I'm not yeah, I'm not entirely convinced about um, anybody with those, those kind of characteristics would make it as a leader. But anyway, um, this is a model. Um, there is one more category: um, somebody who is a middle of the road leader who doesn't do anything well. And again, that is not going to be a um, uh, effective management style. Uh, the organisation will probably be not going anywhere very quickly. Um, so again, the style will depend on the skills and attitude of the manager, um, the particular situation. There may be a situation, arguably, where um, there needs to be more concern for production than the staff's well-being. You could argue that uh, an organisation where the customers are unhappy, um, maybe the staff have not been well managed in the past, we need to get in there, we need to sort out the production and then um, once we've stabilised the organisation in terms of its customers we can focus on staff. Um, you could equally argue that there may be situations where the staff uh, morale needs to be prioritised over production. Um, and the organisational culture, how things are done within a business. Um, so, yep, that's the uh, Blake Mouton leadership grid.